been driving through Europe with this vehicle and I have to say I almost took it back to the cellar because the engine on this car is so disappointing now it's a shame because you know apart from being dis dissatisfied with the engine the rest of the car is superb now what I will do is I'll start going through the good points the good points are the car's interior is wonderful it's absolutely beautiful it's got the modern Audi styling very good quality everything's perfect on the front there's even a lot of headroom which is quite strange considering the size of the car there's plenty of room inside you don't feel that you're in a small car even though from the outside you can obviously see that you are the wing mirrors very large plenty of vision the rear view surprisingly you've got an enormous amount of vision out the window no obstructions at all it's very rare to get that in a car steering on this car fantastic very sharp very responsive this is the six gear manual lovely gearbox can't fault it quite quite a hefty chunky one as well now what I will tell you I find wrong with this car is the engine I don't know what on earth was going through Audi's mind when they put this engine in this car it is absolutely awful listen to this it's like a diesel engine out of a 1980s uh, Mercedes taxi in Morocco it's slow it's sluggish it's it doesn't respond in any way at all and it's just got no pull on it at all this car is slow it's sluggish you know this is just the wrong engine for this car now I'm, I'm emphasizing this point because if anybody is thinking about buying one of these TTs believe me when I say this you want to test drive as many models as possible and this particular car with this particular engine don't waste your time with it you've got a very fancy looking car you've got a car that looks fast a car that is sporty but once you're behind the wheel trust me I think a 2CV could probably keep up with this don't waste your time on this model get one with a good engine a powerful engine a fast engine this is a fast looking car it's a sports car why have a bloody tractor engine in it don't waste your time hunt around with the models find a different model that's the only thing I can find wrong with this car other than one other thing and that's the steering wheel blocks the instrument cluster there are better options this is not the model take my word for it if you don't, take it for a test drive. You'll soon know what I'm talking about.